money worries Malaysian parents have in their 40s. Like this, Yo from Clang Selangor say, my main intention is to get a reliable third party to evaluate my current financial snapshot and from there provide insights on my current financial health, investment, insurance coverage and forward planning in regards to my children's education and ultimately my retirement plan. Now, Yo here could have just took the easy way out of not doing anything different. Just keep on doing what he's doing in his comfort zone. But he did not. Let me explain why this type of forward planning, thinking mindset will help you get further in life, financially and non-financially. Now, the more accurate term for this is what we call the second order thinking mindset. You see, first order thinking is fast and easy, but it is simplistic and superficial. It happens when we look for a quick fix that only solves the immediate problem without considering the longer term consequences. For example, whenever you are hungry, you make it a habit to just buy bubble tea to satisfy your hunger. On the contrary, a second order thinking in this example is much deeper and more deliberate. That means thinking about the health consequences of repeatedly drinking bubble tea loaded with high sugar every day when you are hungry instead of eating healthier, cheaper snacks like cashew nuts. Second order thinkers always ask themselves, and then what? How does this uh, what's the likely result and consequences look like in 10 minutes, in 10 months, or even in 10 years, even 20, 30 years down the road. Second order thinking not only helps you solve problems better, it also helps you avoid future problems and take better, wiser actions towards your children education and retirement goal. Not thinking enough to consider the second order and even the third order consequences is the cause of a lot of painfully bad decisions. But if you do, man, that is how you separate yourself from the masses, which happens to be most of my clients here on our client's testimonial page. Any qualified certified advisor that you seek advice from would be able to do this kind of second order thinking on your behalf for your personal finances. They are not the salesperson, yeah? And this enables you to see things from a different angle, choices that you may not even be aware of, and as a result, you make better informed decisions. Sometimes, we do not know what we do not know, right? And that is how real advisory works. A professional you can bounce off ideas with rather than you talking to yourself inside your head. And now you understand 